everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I am Joyce and I make food, travel, lifestyle, and tutorial videos. And today, I will be sharing with you guys my vlogging equipment and editing software. So let's start with my camera. Sa camera, I'm using my mobile phone which is the Pocophone F1. I'm using mobile phone as my main vlogging camera kasi it's very convenient and very handy. And dala dala mo yung mobile phone mo anywhere. So when traveling, if I don't want to bring my camera, I will just bring my phone. And for my Creo vlog, I also use this phone. The quality is good. And most of the mobile phones nowadays have really good shots. And high-end na phones usually have almost the same quality as a camera already. So if you're starting your YouTube channel, I think that having a mobile phone you're good to go already. So if you still haven't made your channel, ayan, gawa na kayo. As long as you're enjoying what you do, go. Before, on my Taiwan vlogs, I also used my mobile phone, which is the P10 Plus. And I like Leica Cam of Huawei, but that phone got stolen, so I changed to my current phone now. Next for the camera, I actually have this one, which is the PowerShot. XS410 IS but this was just given as a gift. It's a good starting camera for those who want to start vlogging. What this camera is missing is the flip screen. But usually the cameras nowadays may flip screen na sila. You could see how you're vlogging if maayos ba itsura mo. So you could just do like this but for this one you can't see if the angle's right, so it's a point and shoot camera. Most of the YouTubers are using G7X Mark cameras in vlogging. So if you have budget to invest on a good camera, yes, you could do it. So that you have good quality videos, so you could start with that. But if you don't have enough budget, just go with your mobile phone. It's a good start. So next would be the lighting. So my lighting, I usually just use natural light. I usually place myself beside the window. But now I'm using a ring light. I got mine on the size 33cm. Ayan, 12 inches siya. And I just got this for 329. I'll link all the items below so in case you want to check it out. So I use the ring light kasi when it comes to lighting, sometimes nawawala yung sunlight. Kaya nag-upgrade ako with my ring light and I think magagamit ko naman siya for the long term. That's why I invested on ring light and mura lang naman siya. Uh, if you get the 26cm, it's only 270 or less. Next, when it comes to my tripod, tripod and selfie stick. So I use it on my travel vlogs often. So this is the Mi Photo MK10. So what I like about this is it's two-in-one so pwede siya maging tripod and it could also be a selfie stick or you could uh, use it as a tripod so it has three legs and just push it up and also it has a bluetooth clicker which is very convenient because it's attached on the device itself and this one you could also detach the phone holder and if you want to use your camera, you could just uh, place it there. It could also be used on the camera. And also for GoPros, you could also use this. I think it has, it comes with another, uh, another, what do you call that? Another GoPro holder. If I naman ako and I just want uh, it to fit on my bag. So I just got this for free actually on my mom's Huawei phone. You could actually get one that's similar to this one. Very cheap. I think 60 to 80 pesos. Yung parang tripod na maikli lang siya. If you're doing food vlogs, you could just place it on the table. And next, what I'm gonna share is another Bluetooth clicker. So this one, if you just want to have a clicker and you do self-portraits, this one is very convenient. It's the Yun Tang Bluetooth clicker. I bought this for 100 pesos on 168 mall, but you could actually buy this on Shopee for less than 100, I think. So I bought this go two to three years ago. 
when it was on sale. Dahil naka-sale, napabili ako. And I really wanted to have a mic. I bought this on JB Music. So I got this for around 2790 The original price was 4000 plus. So this is the Audio Technica ATR2500 model. And it comes with a stand, mic stand. So this is a condenser microphone. So if you're doing recordings, uh, music covers, this is a good mic to start with. But there are other cheaper mics on Shopee that you could see. And we're done with our equipment. Next would be our editing software. So what I am using as editing on my phone would be CapCut because it doesn't have watermarks and you could easily navigate through the app itself. Ayan, so pag tapos ko mag-film sa phone, I usually merge all of the clips sa CapCut muna bago mag-transfer sa uh, computer ko because parang it saves time. Kunyari wala akong ginagawa, tapos tamad ako mag-open ng PC, I would just uh, edit it through my phone. I could actually have the color grading. Para mas maganda yung lighting ng videos nyo, you could just adjust the contrast, brightness, saturation. Then, my next editing software would be Adobe Premiere Pro when I transfer on my computer. So, ito yung ginagamit ko. Then, next, I also use Canva on some of my editing. In Canva, you could actually make videos if you don't know about that. So, here, you could just select any template that you want. Then, from that template, you just customize it sa gusto yung style. You could actually make intros and outros on Canva. And it has tons of templates to choose from. And it's very convenient because you could find clip arts here. Then next would be a screen capture. If I'm recording tutorials on my computer, I use OBS Studio. You could input your mic there. So pwedeng sabay like you're recording your desktop. Then you could voice over. And for fonts, I usually look for the fonts in Canva and I download them through thefont.com or you could find the other fonts on Google Fonts. So here are some of my favorite fonts. And I guess I have tackled all of my vlogging equipment. Uh, I didn't really invest past the uh, camera ko, but I plan to invest on my phone na lang kaysa sa camera para 2 in 1 na and yun naman yung parati kong ginagamit kaya I plan to upgrade on my phone kaysa bumili ng cam but I might I might change my mind later and so far okay naman ako sa equipment na ginagamit I'm loving the ring light actually kasi it balances out talaga yung lighting compared dati and I guess that's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, huh, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. See you on my next vlog. Bye!